Leonard Thompson, 13 years old, diabetes mellitus, 65 pounds. Starve the child to let them live. The treatment's as cruel as the disease. It's a death sentence. Dr. Banting. This could be it. He's the first to receive this trial. But will it save him? It's not pure enough. So we try again. And again. And again. Before the discovery of insulin, diabetes was a death sentence. Banting, Best, Collop, and McLeod's breakthrough has saved millions of lives. Leonard Thompson's was the first. Even after many years of study, biologists are unable to agree on the number of races of the Canada goose. The largest, as well as one of the smallest geese native to North America, are within the Canada goose category, marked by black neck and head and prominent white cheek patch. The pale-colored giant honker of the eastern prairies may weigh 18 pounds or more, while the small, dark cackler of the Pacific area barely matches the weight of a big mallard duck. Special notes on the Canada goose may be obtained from the Canadian Wildlife Service, Ottawa. Double hockey sticks is going on here. John, I'm leaving. Leaving? Here are my keys. Here are my credit cards. You can't leave. Look, I'll, I'll change, Mary. I, I've tried to get a job. I, I'm I, sorry, John, but I have to live my own life. I need my own career. I have to be me. You. Goodbye, John. No, no, you can't go. Let go, John. No, no. Let go of my leg, John. Let go. Let go. Believe me, I've tried, but you haven't let me, me, me. But I need my freedom. Oh, yeah, you're free to be you when you want to be you. But when I want to be me, who cares? Oh, nobody's stopping you from being you. You're stopping me from being me. But Mary, what about the kids? They're your responsibility now. I need breathing space. I have to find out who I am. Unemployed, out of work, at your wits' end? You from JTEL. Get a job. 25 big working hits, 25 original stars. Need a job? Here's how to get it. Hear great hits like Teen Foreman, Work Around the Clock, Water Cooler Blues, and You Gotta Have a Plan. You gotta have a plan so you know what to do. You gotta have a plan to for you. You gotta have a plan so you know who to call. If you don't have a plan, you know it all. 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 You gotta go. Know it all. 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 Know it all.
She didn't even look at my resume. Ooh. Three o'clock, whoa! Don't be a quitter, honey. Three o'clock, whoa! You'll do it better, baby. Three o'clock, whoa! You're gonna get another chance. Another chance. I gotta show more confidence. I gotta show initiative. I, I, I gotta be more aggressive. Yeah! That's it! Nobody's gonna hire a wimp! I, I gotta sell myself! Yeah, yeah! Sell, sell, sell! I hear you're looking for someone. Well, where do I start? But I can tell you right now, I don't do overtime, and I don't do shift work. Understand? Sit down! Say, this is a swell joint. Nice desk. Hey, do I get my own secretary? <laughs> oh, how many weeks vacation? Uh, yeah, how many coffee breaks? Is there water in the cooler on this floor? Say, hey, can I have your job? Yeah, you look kind of old. Say, when are you going to retire? Hey, buddy! 
Can you spare a couple of bucks? Uh, no, no, I, 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 actually, I'm, I'm, I'm unemployed. Unemployed? Unemployed? <laughs> hey, boy, this guy's unemployed. No, no, I'm, I'm not, I... <laughs> you must be a bum. Yeah, a bum. No, no, I, I, I'm not a bum. I, I'm trying to get a job. Come on, guys. Come on now. Hey, Dwayne, you hire him. Hey, wait a second. Is he qualified? Yes. Let's see his resume. Get, get off my back, you guys. It's not fair. I really want... A job? A job? <laughs> what are you looking at? I, I like to work. Na, 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 no, I want a job. Na, 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 I would work if you found me a job. I, I could do it. I know I would. I'd be the ones if you find me a job. Why don't you help me out? Get off my back. Get a job, get a job, get a job, get a job, get a job with these 25 original hits, 25 original stars. Yours for only $9.95. Paper cassette, $10.95. Available at these fine outlets. Harry, it's Walter, isn't it? Walter has nothing to do with this. That's what they all say. It's Walter, isn't it? I can't stay on. I'd have to find my own career. Hello? Uh, wh what? I got it. I, I got the job? Wow, really? You mean, you like my resume? And the interview is okay? Really? Great! I'll see you tomorrow, 9 o'clock sharp. Thanks a lot. <laughs> Bye, Dad. Yip, 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 yip. <laughs> Numbers are few in the United States. The wolf is still quite common in northern Canada. Wolves on Arctic islands are often snow white, while those found in eastern forests are usually gray-brown. Wolves are gregarious and family life is highly organized. The dominant wolf holds his tail high and eats first. Other members usually know their place, so fights are uncommon. Pups are born in a den that may be cared for by several members of a family group. For more information about the wolf, contact the Canadian Wildlife Service, Ottawa. Oh, he sits there in his red coat, all spit and polished, and he says, Where, Where would you be going? Well, I'm going to the Klondike to look at your gold fields, if there really is any. Not with this gambling gear and those revolvers. Men don't wear pistols in Canada. Canada be damned. I'm going to the Klondike. The Klondike is Canada. Pack those pistols in your saddlebags or get back to U.S. territory. I'm an American. You can't do this to me. In that case, I'll be lenient. We'll keep this gambling gear and you'll be back in the United States by sundown. I... He never drew no gun. I could have shot that guy right there. Who was he, anyway? Superintendent Sam Steele of the Northwest Mounted Police. Why didn't I shoot him? Damn. In the days of the gold rush, a policeman, Sam Steele, became a legend of the Klondike. I don't know. Why didn't I shoot him?
The blue jay is one of Canada's most colorful birds and often one of its noisiest. Its shrill call serves as a warning to other creatures of the woods. The blue jay can be found from Newfoundland to Alberta and prefers to nest in mixed wood forests. Both male and female participate in the incubation of eggs for a period of 17 days. The young are fed all types of food, including insects, caterpillars, and some berries and fruitland grain. The blue jay is one of the few birds that store food for future use, and some of the acorns so stored take root and eventually become beautiful hardwood trees. For more information about the blue jay, contact the Canadian Wildlife Service, Ottawa. This guy. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Columbus, Ohio, weighing in at 218 pounds, the sportsman C.P. Chin. A matchup like this, it's one that the locker room has wanted to see. It's one that the WWE Universe has wanted to see. It's one that I've been waiting to see, and it's about to go down. The competition level has never been higher, but this guy's ready to prove he can hang. Things are about to get good. And his opponent. From Somalia, weighing in at 220 pounds, Big Bad Boom! You know, this person takes some pride in their work, but who could blame them? Few are as gifted in the ring as this performer. Wow, you are laying it on thick, Saxton. Don't worry, I'm sure they'll hear you when they watch this match ten times before bed tonight. A very high-pressure situation ahead for this guy, but he is more than ready for it. This superstar is quite the buzz behind him going into this match. And for good reason. He's proven to be one of the most fearless and determined superstars on the roster today. Certainly determined. We'll see if all that buzz around him is warranted tonight. But don't overlook his opponent. A superstar who is shoulders down. He kicks out instantly. Not even close. Right to the spine. Into the corner. This can't be good. What a rolling elbow. Oh, that hurt. He now just looks helpless to every attack. He's just on the wrong side of every maneuver. He can he score the pin? He's able to kick out before two. Getting the shoulder up before two tells me the end is not near. Man. Ooh. Ooh. Boom. He's taking this to the floor now. Getting carried around, bad spot to be in. Uh, look at this. You don't aim for the apron unless you're looking to do some serious damage. 
He's absorbed some damage already. Showing a lot of fury with these attacks. Yeah, he is showing us a lot out here. Well-scouted reversal there. Yeah, he's getting some newly determined focus. Thrown out of ringside and back to the mat. here from tonight's winner. Yep, that's what we call a good day at the office. Sync got their moves. Here's your chance to get the inside look at how it's done. With Darren's Dance Grooves, the new video that breaks down the moves and shows you how to do them step by step. We step back on our right leg and then move forward. It is definitely the best choreographer of all time. His unique street style dance steps have been featured in music videos, award shows, and concerts seen around the world. Dancing's all about having fun. Now you can get down with my new video. Ain't no lie. Now these fresh moves are available for you to learn on Darren's Dance Cruise. Plus, Darren will show you his brand new pop and lock routine. I break it down so you can learn the dances at your own speed. When you're watching this choreography, you just want to get up and do it with them. Darren's Dance Cruise is not sold in any store. This is going to be the hottest video you've ever seen. To order, call the number on your screen or log on to musicspace.com. Must be 18 or older to call or log on.
Oh, yeah, I am pumped for this guy. The following is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from your darkest fears. Weighing in at 240 pounds, the Iceman this is a match that folks have been clamoring for, and they are excited to finally get it. A man who elevates his game every week. He is competing at his highest level yet. Yeah, now we're talking. And his opponent from Allegiant Fields, weighing in at 244 pounds, the Big Bad Punk Kid. Matches like these, with talent of this caliber, this is why sports entertainment is in art form. He said he'll be making a statement in this match tonight and will deliver it emphatically. Gentlemen, you are looking at a man who is sick of the doubters, sick of being questioned about his potential. And I can't disagree with him. I expect tonight to be a night where he can silence the skeptics and prove to be the future of this company. It will be a tall order, but the confidence he possesses could take him very far. Yeah, but he's taking on a superstar with a mean streak a mile wide. I know, I wouldn't want to be in the ring with this guy. Down to Odin and a double axe handle smash. They're slamming their face down. Axe handle finds the mark. Carefully plays stomp to the arm. Placed in the corner. Boom! And he's taking on a persistent assault. He's got to wake up and get in the fight. Shoulder block. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. Just breaking down the opponent. Right to the face. My God. That's using your head. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. Ah, oh, foot just. His shoulders are down. Determined to keep this matchup going. Rich in the arm. Boom! Oh, fly. And he's adamantly in control. Yeah, he is staying steady and ferocious. Ooh. Moves outside. What's the plan here? Oh, 
he knew what was coming. But he still has more work to do to get this fully in his favor. Off the barricade. Discus knee strike. Letting his opponent know he can take on the world right now. Ouch. Oh, God. Heading back to the ring. That was playing with fire and getting burned. The decision to take such a risk at this juncture is questionable. Now oh, hooking him up. Face buster. He's absorbed some damage already. And another. Nothing was being held back with each of those strikes. He skirts around it. Boom, running STO plants him. Nicely done. He'll head to the ring. Dominating shoulder tackle. One hook with a 10th Street slam. Wow, that is some impressive strength. Dominator. Send a message with that one. Cover! That'll do it! The victory tonight! Here is your winner, the Iceman Bear! Ended this match with a big win under his belt. We call a lot of matches, but this one's going to stick in my mind for weeks. Hi. Megamison here again, here to give you an update on the TJPW Tag Tournament. Only two teams remain. Daydream, Vika Tatsumi and Miyu Watanabe, will go up against Daisy Monkey, Ariso Endo and Susume. The final will take place at a big, almost three hour long event that also has a bunch of other matches. And here now to present those matches is Snooze Cruise. Hi everybody, it's your old pal Snooze Cruise. I have been asked to read the card for the uh, final show of the Max Hart Tournament. I'm going to mispronounce names and trip over my words because I do that a lot. Don't make fun of me. Okay, here we go. Starting us off is Shino vs. Haru. Uh, neither has won a singles victory yet, so someone is getting their uh, first win here. Okay. Following that, we got Yuki Kamifuku, now Kakta, and my hero versus the wrestling polycule of Raku. <gasps> Raku! Palm and uh, Ram Kai Chow. Our third match is Mocha versus the bird, Karatori Bami. After that, we got Shoku Nakajima, Hyper Misao versus Wakana and Himuari. Fifth match is Mizuki versus Zara. Zara, who, uh, Never wrestled in TJPW before, so, uh, exciting guest appearance, whoa! Following that, we have, uh, the Tag Team Champions, but this isn't a tag team match, it's just a match with the Tag Team Champions. Uh, Ryo and Yuki Aino taking on Miyu Yamasha and Toga! For our semi-final, we get a, uh, International Princess Championship match, where, uh, Juri Nagano is taking on the champion, Yuki Arai, the genius girl idol. And finally, we got our main event. Uh, this is White Dragon, Rika Tatsumi, and Miyu versus Daisy Monkey, which is uh, Suzume and Arisu Endo. Uh, it's gonna be some uh, exciting stuff, folks. Uh, I, I love you all. This event will be streamed tomorrow in the Discord at 9pm uh, GMT, but it might start a bit early or a bit late, so keep an eye out for that. Now, back to the show. Hi, Tide Harris! Orlando, Orlando, hear me now! Hi, Tide Harris has the best child! Hi, Tide Harris! Beautiful decor and food galore! Family fun for everyone! Hi, Tide Harris! Delicious 
seafood steak and finger licking chicken. High Tide Harry's. High Tide Harry's in Orlando, South OBT or 436 and 50. The following is an elimination match. Introducing first, from Detroit, Michigan, Heather V. The tension building for this match is so thick you can cut it with a knife. A lot of drama involved with this one. Such a talented competitor. I think we're about to see one of her best matches yet. And from Limbo, the voice. I can't watch this entrance. I heard this one backstage talking up their own work nonstop. Well, why don't they get in the ring and prove it, huh? Uh, that's what they're doing right now, Corey. Well, good. Let's see what they've got then. One of the most anticipated matches we've had in quite some time. And this woman is the reason why. loyalty from this superstar has to go away it's become a detriment there's nothing wrong with having people you can trust in this business and being someone others can trust too woof woof spoken like a true puppy dog saxton She has been counting the weeks, the days, the minutes until this match, and she is now ready to compete. Gentlemen, I think she's about to start a fight. I'll tell you one thing, I don't think I've ever seen a more self-centered superstar in my time here in WWE. Well then, Byron, you've clearly never seen the WWE Hall of Fame. Hey, everyone in the Hall of Fame has a reason to have an ego. This superstar, they haven't earned it just yet. One of the best competitors around, ready to show her skills. Alberta, Canada, the Butcher Kitty. 
Ever since I took my spot here at the commentary table, I have wanted to call this match. I cannot wait to finally do it. One of the top names in the entire women's division, and she plans on showing exactly why here tonight. This superstar is actually happy to risk their own career to help someone out. They are in the wrong business. Corey, I happen to think that's what makes them a good person. They place a higher value on friendship than success. Yet another reason we're not friends. She knows tonight is going to be a big challenge, but if anyone is up for it, it's this woman. One by one, we'll see these tag teams get picked apart in this elimination tag match. Everyone is an individual elimination, meaning team members can be separated as their partner has to head back to the locker room. Tremendous pressure applied. Ooh, whoa. Tagged in. Yeah. Stiff kick. Oh, God, face first. Mounting a downed opponent. Look at them go over and over and over again. And a slap, too. Showing absolutely no mercy at all. What an onslaught. Boot to the stomach gives them separation. Snap suplex. Ah, oh, look at this. Hair pull neck slam. Got their opponent set up. Drop kick to the back. Never saw it coming. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. She's bringing the pressure on now. Yeah, she's proven difficult to grab a hold of. Dominating shoulder tackle. She gets the tag. Set up for the side rush and leg sweep. Elbow. In control here with a swinging neck breaker. Textbook. She is just desperately trying to fight out of it. Back predicament right here. The side. Can she score the pin? She kicks out in one. That's still a quick kick out at this point. Uh, off the rope. Corey, we know a six-woman tag team match can devolve into chaos rather quickly. Any strategy on how to avoid that? Here we go. She certainly took a chance there. High risk with no reward. Countered it just in time. These two having an answer for everything. Oh, what a punch! <laughs> Look at this. Boom, nice. Tag made here. 
Oh, this is going to be bad. And a hammer fist right across the collarbone. He wasn't tough enough contending with one opponent. Now you got to deal with two. Oof. Ah, oh, stops the legs. And look at this now. Yes, applying the submission hold. Oh, I'm not sure if she can escape by this. And yes, she does. Turns the tides. Oh, torturous knee. Gets tagged in. Frankensteiner. Practically never-ending blows. Coming at full force here. First. Oh man, check out this power. Gorilla press slam. Able to get there in time. Look at this. Oh, from the rope. And she's in off the tag. Uh-oh, this is just vicious. Arm stop. Boom. Boom. Tagged with a punch. Things are getting risky. This will not end well. Imagine having to continue competing after eating the apron like that. Reversal! Can she capitalize? Spotted Buster! Oh, just a straight deadlift of power into a dominator! Will it be? I think so! Coming to the rescue. She begins to stir back up, but does it look good? Hold on, she could be looking for a submission move here. Torture rack. Uh-oh, the end is near. No way she's... Not sure why, but she releases the hold. Well, I think she sensed her opponent was about to break free. In off the tag. Oh, what a close line! Did she do it here? Tough way to end your tie. Has been eliminated. Oh, God! really getting fired up. Taking a moment to get pumped off of this crowd's incredible energy. Pump kick on target. Signed, sealed, and delivered. Eliminated. Has been eliminated. Taking it out of the canvas. Look at her. Taking in all the... In Wait a minute. Setting in. Submission coming. Uh-oh, looking to lock it in. Trouble! In trouble! Tough. Look at this. The good thing she got out of that. That would have been nasty. <laughs> Super She's taking a beating here. Yeah, they've held pretty steady throughout this match so far, but it would not hurt to maybe tag out for a bit. And a slap for the exclamation point.
Uh, she's trying, trying to create space. Series of elbows looking to create separation. She does so. Foot to the belly. Taking a moment to get pumped off of this crowd's incredible energy. Tag made. Out on the apron. Oh, this is going to be bad. This is going to be really bad. Back suplex on the apron. Uh-oh. Just toss their opponent. Oh, my! What a splash! Oh, that'll flatten you right out. She's firing up, no doubt about it. And surely she hears how high the referee's count has gotten at this point. What if she does? Maybe she just doesn't care. She's back just in time. Thank goodness I did not want to count out. Power slam. Cover. And she towards the pin attempt in one. Shows that this is still anybody's match at this point. Watch this display of power. Get a sit out powerbomb. Thunderous impact. And the pressure on her keeps escalating. And every attempt of her own offense is being subdued. Huge sit out powerbomb. Oh, Byron, you hear the sirens. Here it is. She just will not go away. In off the tag. Oh, get ready. She knows exactly what she's doing with this. And for some Eight reason, she was going to win it. Could have just been a tease of the potential agony that's yet to come. That's it. Pack your bags. Somehow, these superstars just keep upping the ante. Yeah, no one is backing down now. Not after everything they've been through. Big time atomic truck. I don't have you walking, buddy. Stiff headlock. Torturous focus on the leg. Punishing the leg. Placing them into the corner. Knee finds the abdomen. Find trouble in the corner. And a running knee. Just a tenacious assault from her. Nobody can match up with this woman when she's on a roll like this. Nobody. Top rope. Putting it all on the line. Taking flight. Body splash. Shoulder is lifted before one. Looks like there's some more fight left in her. Yoko Suka cover. Is it enough? The cover. Ah. Uh, Might take her head clean off her shoulders. She's got her in her sights. Back elbow blows that one up. Oh man, the neck breaker. Packed crowd on their toes. This is what it is all about. Knee left. Now tagging her in. What a bionic elbow. This match is wearing her down. These two teams have gone to war, Cole. Of course they're going to wind up with a few battle scars. Oh! She shoots up the top rope. Dangerous thinking. You can see her struggling to find her bearings. Oh, look out. Oh! Shot 
Oh, we all thought that was it. the axe handle. Hold on a second. Could be a matter of time. Submission being locked in. Oh, torture rack. Every bit as devastating as... And she releases the hold as she feels that enough damage has been done. Should have kept on wrenching. Why should have mercy now? Oh, no. She could be caught here. Bad situation for her. Torture rack. Torture rack. Think about all the pain she's in. And she lets her out of the submission. I don't know if it's Mercy or if it's someone who's not done playing with their prey. Look at her stumble back up. Probably seeing double vision. Oh, this is the best. Couple of jabs. A little a shake rattle in her. Knockout victory. This one is over. Here are your winners. What an impressive performance and victory surviving against every other superstar in this match. Yeah, what a match. I can only imagine how they must feel right now. Yeah, a certain amount of pride has to come with surviving this match. Artisanal cheese claims to reside in the gaming zone. It is a place where only the purest gaming can occur, where all notions of humanity are cast aside in the name of Pownage. This is a terrifying place, devoid of even the smallest of human kindness. I fear this gaming zone. I fear this artisanal cheese. As night falls, 37 million Canadians turn out their lights and settle down for the night. But as we sleep, there's something interesting going on. House hippos have returned to Canadian homes, but they're extremely hard to spot. They enjoy admiring their reflections, hoarding socks, helping themselves to your devices, and annoying your pets. It looks like Canada has a house hippo problem. Or do we? We brought back the House Hippo to show how easy it is to be fooled in our digital world. Find out how to tell what's real and what's not at breakthefake.ca. You want to get even? Then get your hands on WCW NWO Revenge. With over 60 of the biggest stars in professional wrestling, featuring all their signature moves and taunts, fans will eat this one up since Nintendo Power. WCW NWO Revenge. With an arsenal of hidden weapons, four player battle royal action, and the bone jarring power of the Rumble Pack. WCW NWO Revenge. Revenge is just too sweet. Only on Nintendo 64. You're so yummy and so sweet, simply all right and proper. I like your fat weight, cause I like them double whoppers. I often hear people on the street laughing about you, but where are y'all skin and bones I couldn't cuddle up on you? You're so yummy, 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 yummy. <laughs> Get moly on your phone. All you have to do is send MAD to 755.55. Or visit Jamster.com, get up to 20 products, and subscribe for only $9.99 a month. Remember, it's Jamster.com. First, I didn't know what to think. Maybe they just celebrated Halloween early in this town. Maybe every day. I began looking for answers. But soon I couldn't get the images I'd seen out of my head. And it was clear that their world was becoming mine. Bad dream, hon? Diablo 2. Play it now on PC and Macintosh. Rated M for Mature.
The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making our way to the ring from Toronto, Ontario, Canada. The Super Athlete Coach. Big time match on tap. When the competition level is this high, you can bet it will be memorable. A major match ahead of her. She plans on proving exactly why she's worthy of big matches like these. Gentlemen, this has all the makings of an all-time classic match, and I fully expect it to deliver on that promise. She knows she deserves to be atop this division, and a win tonight will go a long way towards that. The bell rings, and you have to admit she's like a bull seeing red. All business, no thrills. Once she sets her sights on an opponent, she's on them until she gets the W. Definitely not the type of competitor you want to take lightly. Yeah, but she's facing off against someone who's as stubborn as she is talented. It's not going to be an easy fight at all. A measured punch. Feeling the WWE Universe on another level. This is her fuel. 
And a drop kick. Picture perfect. the old stump puller leg snap. That'll snap your hamstring. You have solidified your name as a top athlete when you're able to pull off that move. Close call, but not enough yet. Ooh, that might have just broken something. And now she's bringing in overwhelming offense. Maintain the aggression. Whoa, oh, what a moonsault. It takes a certain level of athleticism to pull that off. She's beginning to flag a little. Boom! Oh, what an uppercut. Jordan. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah. She's saying, let's go. Bring it. Poison Rana. That's likely to take as much out of one superstar as it does the other. A kick out, and you can see the frustration starting to build. She likely knew that wasn't enough. She's just keeping the pressure on. Knee strike connects. And she's really being knocked around here. She's got to reestablish herself back into the match now. One. Look out! Barrel roll, tope, what? That is tossing your own body around without a care. Taking One. no account for their own well-being. Taking a moment Two. to get pumped off of this crowd's incredible energy. Oh, oh, continued punishment. Damage to the shoulder is definitely going to hamper your ability to fight. Oh, uncorked a big punch. Oh, did you hear that? Ooh, merciless looking. The cover. She overcomes the pinfall attempt. Not yet. to the throat. Slips out of the way. Oh my gosh, what impact. Bam. Oh, that backfired on her. Wrenches the arm. Drop kick. Beautiful. Able to reverse. All the way up and around the world. Crucifix head scissor. Agility like that, easier said than done, gentlemen. Soaring. Wow, she lands hard. Oh, ouch. Popped up. Whoa, change of plans. Pop up German. Into the pin attempt. Not yet. Drop kick. Knees up. Knees were up. All the breath taken out of their body with that counter. Places her right in the corner. <laughs> a gnarly headbutt to the face of their opponent. And I have a bad feeling things are about to get even worse. Making the climb. This will not end well. Bonsai drop. Off into the pin. She's still as determined as ever. Telling her opponent that she has even more left in her tank. Into the ring again. Uh, tilt the world. Gonna follow this up with a leg drop. She's starting to drag a little bit. Not a bad place to be in, but the longer this goes, the more trouble a superstar exposes themselves to. Take your time, enjoy it. Boom! Before the fist drops on your face. Oh, 
counters right into the bread basket. Shoulders down. Could she finally put this away? She breaks the ref's count. Still has a great amount of fight in them. Not going to let it end like this. Crushing knee strike. She's getting fired up. Ready to show her opponent what she's got. Big boot. She's about to rise up to something catastrophic. Up and up. The slams. Red. That puts her in total control. Oh, she's still alive. Just when you think it's the end, she stays alive. What amazing resilience. Oh, looks like we're going to see it. Selena Del Sol. Is it enough to secure? She did it. She picked up the victory. Here is your winner. Carlos. She's got to be proud of this win. Every single victory in this business means. The blue dini is an aberration, a construct of fat and gristle. He is the embodiment of mankind's gluttony. His slow, waddling strut represents the cool ease with which industrialized nations may rain annihilation upon the poor at their leisure. His corpulent size is emblematic of the greed and gluttony of Western society. He is truly a disgusting creature, and the sight of him gives me diarrhea. When people talked about a unique burger, Mr. Mike's listened. When people talked about a fish burger just a little bit different, Mr. Mike's listened. When people talked about a chicken burger, Mr. Mike's listened and heard it first. Mr. Mike's brought it to the people, and they just ate it up. Hey, fellow, what's the name of that crazy dancer doing? Get into the groove simply by hiring a Much Music Video Dance Party. Does that sound completely incredible? Yeah, uh -huh. Presented by your local butler of Coca-Cola Classic, it's the perfect party package complete with sensational sound and lights, plus all the videos you crave. The hope of every civilization, of every nation. Yeah. So book a date now for your prom or grad dances. The Much Music Video Dance Party, brought to you by your local butler of Coca-Cola Classic. Let it rock. Look who's here! The following contest is a tag team match set for one fall. On the way to the ring, at a combined weight, of 507 pounds. And guys, this looks to be a match with major implications here in WWE. Could change the entire landscape here. Better get ready. And their opponents at a combined weight of 455 pounds. The Naughty Guys. 
The tag division has been extremely competitive as of late. Every duo looking to show why they run things around here. Underway, truly one of the hallmarks of sports entertainment. That's right, Colin. As a former tag team champion myself, I have to say these matches hold a special place in my heart. Beautiful gator roll. Yikes. Great way to disorient your opponent. Front face lock applied. It's about to get more painful. Top row one suplex. He's going for it all. Oh boy, he's stalking him. Watching for an open. Watch out. Oh. And tag. He's in now. Finally. Set him up for the Russian oh. leg sweep. Nicely done. in the chest as well. No. Slingshot sent on. Yes. Throwing all costs into the wind and leaping to the outside. High angle exploder suplex. And the knee. Oh, you can tell he's feeling it now. This fight is pumping him up. Oh, man. He's fighting hard, and it's paying off. We are looking at an unyielding attack from him. Oh. We could have been looking at a count out there. Yeah, you just know that would have been a deflating result for the WWE Universe. Just deadlifting their opponent, tossing their opponent like they're nothing. Was definitely not thinking about finesse with that one. Was only thinking about dominance. Shoulder tackle. Have you ever seen a human being tossed like that? I don't think people realize the amount of strength it takes to hurt someone like that. The suplex. He's taking some good hits. Elbow drop. Piercing. You can see the anguish growing on his face. Yeah, but he's always one counter away from changing things. Oh, an elbow drop. The adrenaline is pumping, and the WWE Universe is on. Can he do it here? Shoulders up. He couldn't make much of that pin attempt. And the electricity of this moment is coursing through his veins. Yes, tag. Big boat. Oh, get it, get it. Pop that booty. Work into the moonsault. Love it. A move like that is what sets you apart from other superstars. Headbutt to the gut. Suicide. Oh. That was nuts. No sign of hesitation. And that risk gained big rewards. And there was some force on that move. Three. 
and a series of vicious stomps. You have to imagine the disdain it takes to repeatedly stop someone like that. Oh, man. Kick to the gut. And that was a precisely measured attack. The damage he's taken is starting to pile up. This match continues. Across the top rope, all the way to the floor. Big back body throw. You see the height on that? Vicious. Saw that coming. A little thunder roll. Going up top. Taking flight, diving body splash. Two, and he fights it off. Somehow, some way, he is still in this. There's some power behind that punch. Oh, that can rock you. Close line. Oh, my Look at goodness. This. From the ground up. Into a power slam. And more attacks to his core could hinder his offense. And he's able to reverse. Effective shoulders down. Quick count out after one. Wow, I thought for sure that was it. Off the attack with an elbow. Midsection and a back fist. Effective. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. Gets the tag. And here comes the pitch. Home run. What are they doing here? And they just busted out an impactful maneuver. He's in a little bit of trouble now. This is what the purpose of a tag team is. Don't be afraid to use the resources and help your partner offers. Am I being diplomatic enough, Cole? Knee straight to the gut, stays off the attack. Getting him into the corner. Wicked clothesline. Reaches his partner for the tag. Boom! Uh-oh. What a takedown. Fujiwara armbar. Ah, oh, Fujiwara armbar applied. Ah, oh, striking with an A. Oh, just manhandling their opponent. And there's the fallaway slam. <laughs> belly to belly. Vicious. Measured up nicely. This drop. Using the ropes for momentum. Thunder as leg drop connects. He's getting pushed. Play it possum. Whoa. Play it possum. There's a shoulder up almost immediately. What's it going to take to put this match away? He's able to fend off the attack. This has become a monumental clash. There are no breaks on these competitors. The will, the fire, the guts. You can feel their emotion. Whatever's playing here can't be good. Uh-oh. No! with a suplex. That was impressive. A uh, stop right to the gut. Look what he's got here. Driven down with an elevated flatliner. Oh! With authority! 
trying to find his bearings, but it looks like his end is near. Oh, look at that. The Moose! Placing them right where they want them, into the corner, turning the tables there. Finds the advantage after a string of counters. Lining up for something spectacular. Oh, and a big clothesline. That puts him in total control. For the win! Kicked out in one! Even the ref can't believe it! What? What just... I can't. Uh, agreed, Saxton. Looks like there's no limit to how much damage this superstar can absorb. That was plan A, and it didn't work. He must be thinking about plan B at this point. This place is going insane! The ground beneath my feet is shaking. Nice go behind. Into a high impact backdrop suplex. A monstrous German suplex. Will the third time be the charm? The tripleta. Good night. Cover. Well, what a save. Corey, that should have been three. I couldn't agree more. Extraordinary amount of abuse. He made the setting up. Driving the face down. Get that instant replay ready. Is it enough? The cover. There's two. And the victory. Here are your winners. The Naughty Guys. Making their case for one of the best teams around with that win. Two men with one common goal can be a dangerous thing. They're putting the entire locker room on notice. I now speak of the famous fighter, Roxy. She is thanked by all. I too thank her. Roxy should be thanked. But why do we thank Roxy? Roxy efficiently posts the bets before every match. Roxy moderates the chat. Roxy tempers the worst impulses of the wrestling tyrant known as the Swizzler. But Roxy represents far more than those provincial needs. Roxy is the shield that protects us from wrestling anarchy. She prevents the true nature of life from seeping into the fantasy of the ring. When you hug your children, when you kiss your spouse, you must thank Roxy. Bun. It's a very big fluffy bun. Big fluffy bun. It's a very big fluffy bun. Where's the beef? Some hamburger places give you a lot less beef on a lot of bun. Where's the beef? At Wendy's, we serve a hamburger we modestly call the single. And Wendy's single has more beef than the Whopper or Big Mac. At Wendy's, you get more beef and less bun. Hey, where's the beef? I don't think there's anybody back there. You want something better. You're Wendy's kind of people. Holy 
Family Cannoli Kids. I'm Mario, and I'm telling you, if you're not watching the Super Mario Brothers Super Show, you're going to turn into a Goomba. Don't be the last on your block to be playing with pasta power. Tune in for the wildest weekday fun in the universe. Join me, Luigi, Princess Toadstool, and Toad. We're going to kick some Koopa. Woo! The Super Mario Brothers Super Show. Afternoons at 4 in Channel 43's Kids Land. And here he comes! The following contest is a tag team match set for one fall. Introducing first, from Uzbekistan, weighing in at 228 pounds, Mr. Number One! We're looking at some of the most intense competitors in all of WWE, about to take part in one of the most anticipated matches ever. A man who always gets a strong reaction from the WWE Universe, and it will only intensify once the bell rings. Here we go, guys. And his partner from Baltimore, Maryland, Weighing in at 270 pounds, Sweet Daddy Sweetness. I've been thinking about it, and there is no one I trust less than this person. This is someone that would turn on anyone, even their own family. It's called looking out for numero uno. Number one, Saxton. No one's going to help you win or help you get title opportunities. At the end of the day, you can only count on yourself. He has a big match ahead of him. Going to need a career-making performance here tonight. And here they come. And at a combined weight of 767 pounds. Oftentimes with teams, you know one member is better than the other. These are two superstars who are equally high level. Time for some tag team action. These two will be starting things off for their respective teams as we get into this. Wow, what impact! Oh man, that was nasty. They weren't that good looking anyway. Elbow 
drop. Piercing. So smart, targeting the opponent's leg. Yeah, and then watch this. Oof. Carefully plays stomp to the arm. And now he's really falling behind. Yeah, the defects in this game are leaving him vulnerable. This match grinded him down a little. Paying it right back with a reversal. Oh, ooh, what a knee lift. Somebody better check his nose. Line. This could do it. Power in at it, one. Showing his determination there with that kick out. And an elbow drop, too. Ooh. Thrust right to the throat. Man can't breathe, the man can't fight. Ooh. Well measured. And he wants nothing to do with any of that. Suplex. Taking a moment to let the crowd know how much he appreciates them. Appreciate him while you can, folks. He's not getting paid by the hour. What's he putting together? Able to get out of the way. Beautiful suplex. Disrupts the attack with an elbow to the gut. What are you guys thinking? Obviously not about the rest count, Cole. He wants even more out of his opponent. Forearm club. Close line. Well, that'll leave a mark. He got whipped into that corner. Running hip attack. What impact. Oh, look at this ruthlessness in the bottom turnbuckle. Tagged into the action. Shoulder tackle. Look at him totally vibing with the WWE Universe right now. Got the tag. Got the tag. Taking it to the shoulder. Makes him pay with a counter. Man, that was a hard landing. He's looking a little off balance. Hooked up, driven down. The better part of Valor. Ooh. Oh, touch. Nasty. Big splash. Uh-oh, caught by the back of the elbow. Set out to the center of the ring. Oh! Double super kick! That was that chemistry you cannot teach. Big back body draw! You see the height on that? Delivers the headbutt right between the eyes. Does the official not see him removing the turnbuckle pad? Keep your voice down. Back suplex! He thinks he has it. Kick out in one. Still no end in sight here. Landing on the spine. Look at that, Saxton. He's running away. Uh, I wouldn't say that. He's just recomposing himself.
There's a snapmare. Followed by the knee drop. Out of fracture in orbital. He turns it around. Beautiful swinging neck breaker. Tag is registered. Close line. Cloy the face. Is this necessary? Rip it at the eyes. Oh, back elbow. Oh my gosh! With one hand. Oh man. He's lost some of his win now. Painful attack focused on the chest. Tag switching it up. Drops it with a big shoulder tackle. Grabbing a hold of the arm. Oh, hip drop. in the corner. Oh, my gosh! Staggering to his feet, but he won't like what's coming next. From the middle row, moved out of the way. That could change the whole complexion of this match. Oh, what a strike to the back. Elbow will break that up. Uh oh. Face first. Pinpointing the leg. Ooh, we might be close to the end. Holding on by a thread, maybe even less at this point. Absolutely spiked. DDT. Attack on the knee. Oh, yeah. Let's just all take a moment to truly appreciate and embrace his presence. And he gets the tag. Got him with a big boot. On the mark. Bam! Down he goes. Powerless position to be in right now. No, oh, someone called a dentist. Corner trapped in the corner for the win. He kicks out with force. What stamina! It's truly impressive to completely beat the count here. Oh, jarring back elbow. Oh, oh no, 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 no! A big splash. Standing over there, opponent. Here comes. Certainly do it. Two, three, no, two count. He's taking some serious hurt, but somehow he's still in this. I think he managed that kick out on pure instinct alone. All of that work, all these big moves, and it still didn't earn the fall. Kick it out before the count. He's still got more left in the tank. Implanted by the DDT. He is just reeling from that offense. These two teams have gone to war, Cole. Of course they're going to... We'll be looking to end things here with the Cobra Clutch. Fading quickly. Ah, oh, just tap out. Just tap out and end this thing. No, he lets him out. Yeah, I think he knew he wasn't going to get the submission there. And I ask, the way these combatants have been unloading on one another, how are they still going? I think they're running up. He could pin his opponent right here. It's over. Yeah, no, he doesn't get the three. How in the world did he kick out? Pat, that one's 
scouted. With the lariat. He's in off the tag. Boom, running STO plants him. Nicely done. Here's the snapmare. Followed by the knee drop. Got a fracture in orbital. Tagged in. Well executed takedown. He's tagging out. Oh, what a DDT! Wow. He has to be at his limit now. Might want to walk it off or shake it off or do whatever he needs to do to get his head in the game here. Big knee to the midsection. Partner tags in. Now a series of vicious out in the turnbuckle. Stumps. Oh, this is just too far. Get some control in there. Oh, look at this aggression, just oh, pure brutality. Come on, easy. Ooh. Ah, knee left. Oh, no, 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 no. He's looking completely lost as he finds his footing. Into the full Nelson. It's cinched in deep. I think he's got it locked in good. I just don't know how to counter this thing. I don't want to see him tap out. Got it. What a tag match we just saw. Here are your winners. And teamwork makes the dream work in this tag team victory. This right pairing can certainly do wonders, and make no mistake, this was a wonderful performance tonight. This Tech Popo individual is the sum of our collective fears. The skeleton, a symbol of death, and the bear, an implacable predator. He has taken these primal terrors as his own persona to intimidate his opponents. His opponents may be frightened, but I find his visage comforting. The skeleton represents death, but it is an inevitability, a universality, we can all relate to. The bear does not frighten me either, for his motives can be understood simply. The bear is hungry, and we are food. The certainty of these facts brings me solace. Be afraid. Be very afraid. One life-sucking Metroid survived the first Metroid adventure, and it's multiplying rapidly. You must help Samus save the universe again in Metroid 2. So we're giving you more power and mightier weapons to search a bigger world where hundreds of strange enemy life forms lurk. Destroy or be destroyed. Metroid 2, the return of Samus, only on Game Boy. The future is in your hands. Morning. The following offer is for mature audiences only. Exciting. Mysterious. Intense. Graphic. Provocative. Raw. This is no ordinary animation. This is the exotic, bizarre, and beautiful world of Japanese anime. And this is your invitation to enter with the modern classic Akira. 
Critics say Akira makes Blade Runner look like Disney World. It's action-packed, the future of animation. Siskel and Ebert call it the video pick of the week. Akira is yours for only $4.95 with subscription when you order the best of Japanese animation collection series. With these state-of-the-art sci-fi classics, you will enter a world beyond imagination, a future out of control, and an experience you will never forget. Don't say we didn't warn you. Call 1-800-414-4422 now to order Akira for only $4.95 plus $3.79 shipping and handling. Future volumes are $19.95 plus shipping. Mature audiences only. What are you talking about? Yeah, what horse? The high horse this superstar always seems to be on. Did Jerry Lawler write that line for you? A woman meant for the highlight reel. She plans on even more excitement tonight. like these with talent of this caliber this is why sports entertainment is in art form One of the best competitors around, ready to show her skills. And just looking into her eyes, you can see that she's as focused as ever for this one. Keeping her head on the swivel and her eyes on the prize. That's what this business is all about, Cole. She knows just how important a win in this one could be, and she's going to keep that in mind here. And she has to face a woman who has been at the top of her game. It's going to be hard for anyone to take on a superstar with the kind of trajectory she's been on lately. But the DDT! She is looking highly motivated, getting hyped up. She is in a jam now. Brutal face buster. And into the count. Shoulder up and the referee ends the count. Not getting the two at this point has got to say something. Standing moonsault gets all of it. It's hard enough to do a moonsault from the ropes, but standing... Uh-oh! Suicide dive! Whatever it takes. 
match to win. That is the attitude of a daredevil. The ability to take risk with minimal trepidation. No fear, absolute reckless abandon. Saw it coming. Close line. What impact. Solid punch. Ooh, sharp elbow. hard ways to land, but that might be the hardest. And an elbow to the head, too. And the momentum's clearly gotten away from her now. She has to rely on her instincts to turn things around. She's got her now. Ring rattling! And now she's climbing to the top turnbuckle. From the top... She still has to do more to get this fully in her favor. Hey, effective arm drag. Carefully placed stop to the arm. Looking for something big here. This will do it up and broken arrow. Can she do it here? She is still fighting, still keeping this going. She's getting back up, but she might be down again soon. Drop to her, take down, take down. Leg is trapped, what a transition. Right into the STF. Scraps thinking something else here. Not sure why though, Michael. She seemed to have it really cinched in. Off to the top rope now. From the heavens. Taking a moment to get pumped off of this crowd's incredible energy. Taking this one back to the ring now. Our head scissors. Round and round we go. What a maneuver. Oh, snapping the leg and bang. And now she's looking to go top rope. From the heavens, you gotta be kidding me! Coming down on their opponent like a sack of bricks. Vicious knee drop. She's gaining momentum here, guys. She's reading everything her opponent is trying to throw at her. And look at her, feeding off the WWE Universe's energy. Uh-oh, she can be set up for a submission here. The camel clutch! Digging it in as deep as possible. Well, this won't win the match, but it's one way to inflict a great deal of punishment. And she lets her free. But the damage was certainly done, Michael. Boom, right across the small of the back. She's just getting worked over right now. Yeah, she's in desperate search for answers now. Tracks. Slam. I think that'll do it. Shoulders down. What a kick out at two. Somehow, some way, escapes defeat. Still alive. And now it's reload time. Time to find another moment to pull off that one more time. Yeah. Boom, running FT. And this has got to be it. And she breaks the count. This battle rages on. Oh, yeah. She is really getting fired up. Square impact across the shoulder. She's showing signs of slowing down. This is where endurance becomes so important in the late stages of the match. Down to Odin. 
and a double axe handle smash. And now she's setting the pace of this match. Yeah, she's riding rough shot up. From way up, look out below! You want to talk about putting it all on the line. Always an extra risk when you dive ringside. Oh, just deadlifting their opponent and tossing their opponent like they're nothing. And the hits to the core keep coming. Kick to the lower back. What a beautiful moonsault. That's another focused attack to her torso area. Oh my goodness. Kick to the spine. Oh, right to the leg. Count out of it. She needs to get back in. And now thrown back into the ring. And she was dead. Uh, roll the credits. This one's done. Drop kick. And momentum. She's going for it. Picked up the victory. Here is your winner. The... We have here one of the masterminds of this pantomime of murder and horror, Sting 64. He styles himself after the legendary wrestler known as Sting and appends the number 64. The number 64 is numerologically associated with self-determination. In this, he exposes his insecurities and hubris, seeking to gain mastery over a world that cares nothing for his success or failure. He is terrified of the random nature of the universe and weeps silently in his bed nightly. You should do the same. Escape. You better get them before they get you. The drums of war are beating. No man can be trusted. What happened to Dorcas? I put poison in his mutton. <laughs> Build an army. Trust nobody. Fire emblem. Only on Game Boy Advance. Rated everyone. Game Boy. Oh, are you guys ready? The following contest is a tables match. Making his way to the ring from Tulsa, Oklahoma, weighing in at 193 pounds, the Extreme. Some would say the superstar thinks a little too much of themselves, but the tape doesn't lie. This is a serious contender for any title. They need to loosen up, have a little fun. Heck, maybe even lose a match once in a while. What? That is horrible advice. And here comes one of my favorites.
Take a look at the talent in competition here. You can see exactly why the WWE Universe is so amped up for this one. He's in perhaps the best physical condition of his life. He knows what it takes to reach the top here in WWE. This tables match officially underway. It won't be long now until there's furniture in the ring. So hopefully these superstars don't make the WWE Universe wait too long. These people want to see some tables. Uh-oh. I hope you're not afraid of Tigers. Tiger suplex. Getting set up for something in the corner. That'll cost him teeth. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. And he goes into the ring. Follow-in moonsault. Wow. There it is. Snap suplex. Sharp elbow to the gut turns that one around. Effective arm drag. Knees up, saw it coming, and was laying in wait. Ah, oh, spike face first. Corey, what is the approach in a match like this that is so singularly focused on a specific end result? Oh, there's no secret in this one. Every bit of offense is done with the goal of putting your opponent through a table. Create as much chaos as possible to put your opponent on the defensive. Well, it's all about the chaos. A competitor could be so focused on defending against a mounting offense that they become distracted from the threat of going to the table. All I know is someone's going to end up splitting some lumber, and I can't wait to see who it is. And look at this now, bad intentions coming with this hold. Oh, the heel hooks in! He's fighting out of it. Successfully does a couple of effective shots. Short clothesline hits its mark. Prying their opponent's arm out, carefully measured double stop. Looking for here looks like a potential submission maneuver. A single leg camel clutch and a great counter. Trump with a suplex. The sidekick finds the mark. Uh oh. What a takedown. Fujiwara armbar. Ah, uh, Fujiwara armbar applied. Getting the upper hand by taking away your opponents. He's got a plan for that table, and it does not involve a dinner party. Oh. Can't break in the midsection. Oh, targeting the arm. This has got to hurt. Pulverizing the arm is a great way to create an advantage, basically forcing your opponent to fight one-handed. 
I guess he thinks the one thing missing in this match is a steel chair. Oh, getting smacked in the head with a chair. Able to avoid any harm there. Strength with the German. Setting up the table. He is done playing around. Dropped with the cutter. Heads out and he has all the time he wants. Back in the ring now. Set up. Oh boy. He leaves the ring and there's no countouts in this one. Of all the toys underneath the ring, he just had to go with the one that ensures splinters. Ooh. Kick right to the body. He's absorbing some tough hits now. I think we're about to see a body go through a table real soon. He's looking for an implement of destruction under the ring. to the floor. Okay, he's re-entering the ring. Effective arm drag. He's doing some dangerous redecorating. I think the table really ties it all together. This is dangerous here. Oh, no, don't. And that will do it. Not getting up from that one, so it's called. Here is your winner, the Going through the table like that adds salt to the wound of losing. It's never fun to lose, but the added pain of going through a table is insult to injury. Every match. Harry Sears is a self-made showman. I've got two of the most sensational kids to ever hit this business. With a traveling act that hits the road every day. Why are we doing all the punching when we're playing all the guilt? And opens every night. What a fantastic <laughs> show you girls put on tonight. He's got taste. He's got patience. All right, that makes 30. There's your five cents. I have no pennies. I'll have to go inside. I'll wait. He's got clout. You can't be nice to these things. They only understand one thing. And he's got respect. Wow! He's going from the bottom of the barrel. Stick with me and I'll have your name up in lights. We know. To the top of the heap. And he's taking his boys along with him. The California Dow! MGM presents Peter Falk. That's right! Vicki Frederick and Laureen Landon in All the Marvels. If I had a thought, an idea for you girls, that it could be sensational. We are not getting tattooed, Harry. Harry and the girls have been through the ropes. Oh. And back. There's no bones broken, just maybe a bad strain. Stay off your back for a few days. Here goes your social life. They've taken their lumps. We never said you weren't a good manager, Harry. Just a lousy human being. The hard knocks. I'm not turning myself into a sideshow freak for you or anybody else. No way. And the mudslinging. You're a lousy lover. You're a lousy manager. Now that really hurts. I am not a lousy manager. But they've always come back for more. 
Now, the girls are a class act. They deserve to get paid. If I wanted a class act, I'd get the Bronte sisters. My dolls would tear their legs off. They've got grit. <laughs> guts. <laughs> class. <laughs> and style. You are the champions. And the California dolls are greedy for your title. So remember, pride. And tonight, they're going for all the marbles. Win or lose, I love you both. But we come too far to lose. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, from the future, the Cyborg! Just look at the swagger on display. I love it. Swagger. Really, Saxton? You know a number of people in the back just despise this superstar. Well, the WWE Universe clearly disagrees with you, Corey. Oh, and what else is new? A woman meant for the highlight reel. She plans on even more excitement tonight. We are about to see something good. And her partner from Finland, weighing in at 262 pounds, Mike the Hippie. You are looking at some highly motivated competitors in this match, looking to steal the show and capture the attention of the entire WWE Universe. Doesn't matter where or when he's competing, this guy just wants to fight, and he's about to get one. Someone who's so beloved by the WWE Universe, you'd think this superstar wouldn't be so afraid to actually get to work in the ring. Ah, discretion is the better part of valor, Corey. <laughs> and we are looking at the epitome of valor right now.
one of the top names in the entire women's division, and she plans on showing exactly why here tonight. The WWE Universe just exploded! And her partner from Sin City, weighing in at 247 pounds, Ted Piccone! Ruthless aggression is alive and well, and this superstar is living proof. Ruthless aggression is overrated, Saxton. Whatever happened to being ruthful? How come nobody ever uses that word anymore? Always walking around with a chip on his shoulder. He's going to use that anger against his opposition. Get ready for the best of both worlds. It's time for mixed tag match. Attacking the body. Oh, God. She shoots up the top rope. Dangerous thinking. She has her target weighed and measured. Up high. She comes up empty. Ooh, stinging kick. And here we go now. Elbow drop to the knee. What oh, now? Belly stop. Oh. She tagged out, but if you ask me, I think her opponent wanted a break too. Dropped him with a big shoulder tackle. Oh, complete dead left. This is incredible. Gut wrench shoot. He can do it here. Gets the shoulder up instantly. He is going to take this match as long and as far as he needs to. In full control here. Face full of turnbuckle. Knife edge chop echoing through the arena. Oh, what a chop. So ruthless. to the chest. Oh, that'll leave a mark. Reversal. Can he take advantage? Look at this. Going right after the left arm. Gotta hurt. Making the arm numb makes your opponent very vulnerable. Brutal short arm lariat. He's getting a little batter now. <laughs> Reigns down an elbow in retaliation. What a counter! Ah, oh, targeting the arm. This has got to hurt. Hard to grab or apply a proper hold after a move like that. Right on the arm. Not where you want to be right now. Boom! Goes under the ropes to get back inside. Sight set on the top rope. They're still in this. Oh, kick right in the back. Typical guy hiding behind his woman. Oh, drop kick. Right on the money. Oh, quite an effective counter. Big 
Big-time clothesline. Good grief. She tags out, so now it's the men one-on-one. -on -one. Dropped it with a big shoulder tackle. He's struggling a bit here. This is when you have to take advantage of tag team rules and get yourself some breathing room. No good reason to stay in this right now. Strong oh. Lariat! The WWE Universe giving him an extra shot of adrenaline. Enough already. <laughs> what a clothesline! Ouch. He gets the tag, and that means his opponent has to switch with his partner, too. Clothesline! Oh, straight forearm. Chest. Oh, yeah, she is really showing her confidence. Oh, strong impact. She's forced onto the defensive now. Oh, pinpoint kick to the back. She's holding on tight. A cutter. And now she has the sturdy upper hand. Really taking control here. Uh-oh, diving headbutt, good night. Two, oh, barely kicks out. She just won't stay down. Right to the chest. Oh my God. Look at this, just stop after stop after stop. Hooked up here. Legs trapped, just like she envisioned. Is it enough? The cover! There's two! Wow, just barely making it out. I truly thought it was all over there. Talk about resilience. Yeah, but did you see how the referee had to get into position? That was all the difference. The heaviest artillery has been used, but it's not enough for the three. Hooked up here. Leg trapped. Huge turning point right here. For the win. Two. Finally over. Here are your winners. Tag team chemistry in full effect with these two superstars. I wouldn't have expected these two to perform well together, but they looked impressive in victory. It's a fine day, people open windows, they leave their houses just for a short while. They walk by the grass and they look at the grass, they look at the sky. It's going to be a fine night tonight, it's going to be a fine day tomorrow. Kleenex tissue this. If you look as broad as this, and you'd rather look as slim as this, try the AIDS reducing plan. Delicious tasting AIDS candy contains vitamins and minerals, no drugs. Taken with a hot drink before meals, AIDS helps you curb your appetite. You eat less because you want less, so you lose weight naturally. Thousands of men and women have lost weight on the AIDS plan. You can too. Why not try AIDS? They work. I'm tired of candy, tired of gum, tired of hunger, and food that's no fun. I'm tired of pretending I don't like spaghetti, but school lunch keeps me roaring ready and rock steady. Pizza, spaghetti, burgers.
With Chow Daddy in your school cafeteria, it's the fun place to be for lunch. Desserts. Kinder. Yibbo Shaky. Me on Scrabbly. Chocolate Doobie! Dumbly Chocolate Doobie! Pop Swabble! <laughs> Toy! Yodel Yum and Choco Scrum with multi Pop Swabble dies! Oh, Grubbly! <laughs> Me Scrubble now! Snuggle! Whee! Kinder Surprise from Ferrero. Gunner! 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 Hot Glee Hot! Gunner! 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 Hot Glee Hot! It says pancakes on the outside, but there's a lot more on the inside. And the prices? Designed for the very hungry family. Yeah, now we're talking. The following is an Extreme Rules match. Making his way to the ring from the internet, weighing in at 253 pounds. If this person spent as much time focused on their ring work as they do for standing up for what they believe in, they'd maybe be undefeated. Corey, I think sometimes a person's courage and character speaks louder than their record. Really? Show me the last time someone got a title match because of their courage and character. He is in perhaps the best shape of his career, and he will need that with the competition level this high. All right! I love this guy! And his opponent, representing the Wolfpack from South Carolina, weighing in at 202 pounds, little homie Dickie! This is the kind of match the WWE Universe has been dreaming of. And that dream is about to become a reality. A guy who treats every match as if it's the biggest one of his career. He definitely plans to steal the show tonight.
There's no telling what a competitor is capable of when they're battling under extreme rules. Oh, make no mistake about it. This match is high stakes, high risk, and high reward. A mistake here can take years off your career. Yeah, it's impossible to predict what kind of danger awaits because everything and anything is legal here, gentlemen. Clover Leaf Stretch. Attacking the spine can instantly limit someone's mobility. Every movement hurts when your back's injured. Oh, incredible Dragon Suplex. Oh, just turn that around. Locks in the gut wrench. Suplex. Claw in the face. Is this necessary? Rip it at the eyes. Prime example of working smarter, not harder. That's what I say. Oh, my! He's turning the tables. DDT! Arm ringer applied. Down for a European arm breaker. What advice would you give to someone going into an Extreme Rules match? Well, if there's one thing these matches have taught us, it's that creativity usually wins the day. Don't just swing a chair. Find a way to make the stipulation work for you. Back suplex! Spine crushing. Hitting the edge of the ring like that can do some lasting damage to the body. Thrown out of ringside and back to the mat. Knee lift! He's looking a little off balance. A little oh. insult to your injury. Cover, cover! Gets the shoulder up in one. Doesn't bow well if you still can't get more than a one count by now. Getting tossed around. <laughs> I honestly can't believe we just saw a human being tossed like that. Crank in the head. A oh, bear hug. Squint furiously trying to fight his way out of the bear hug. Can he do it? Yes. Oh, driving the elbow. Hook his arm for a Fujiwara arm bar. Ah, uh, Fujiwara armbar applied. He thinks he has it. And he powers out. This could be a tipping point in this match. <laughs> Launched with a belly to belly. Outside the ring now, he has no need to rush. He's got a ladder now. He could be contemplating something very risky. And this one might be headed ringside. Driven into the barricade. Oh, man. Oh, what a knee. What's he open to find down there? That table has only one destiny, and it involves being broken in half. Quick return to the ring. He may be in a bad way here. Part of the territory when you're in an Extreme Rules match, Cole. How's that for a counter? Big knee to the midsection. The WWE Universe is pouring more fuel on his fire right now. Knee right to the gut. And will this be it? Oh my, how in the world did he kick out of that? Loose cover leads to a strong kick out. Look at the arm for a Fujiwara arm bar. Oh, Fujiwara arm bar applied. You can see the intent behind that attack. Exploiting the arm must be the strategy here. Effectively targeting the arm. 
and he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. Oh no, now that he has the kendo stick, I definitely do not want to be in his path of destruction. Ooh. What now? Goodness, inverted suplex. Ducks under. Let's go behind. Instead, what a German suplex. Hooked up. Boom! Oh, package driver. And he tosses it back in now. Shooter cinched in. Give up now. Swallow. And he may have felt his grip slipping, so he releases the hold. And still was able to produce some considerable damage, though. Those are folding chairs, but they can also fold you in half. He's got the chair set up. Oh, boy, this is not going to be good. And proving a bit slippery for them there. Ooh, where's the haymaker? Into the corner. This can't be good. Bang! Oh, right across the solar plexus. Oh, kept right in the gut. You can see as he rises how vulnerable of a position he's in. Uh-oh. Cross face. Submission locked in tight. Nowhere to go. No escape. This could be the... And it rolls him off. Effective. Heads out and he has all the time he wants. Oh no, a sledgehammer. Better call the paramedics right now. Shoulders down. Kicks out. He just won't give up. He has been here before and he knows what he needs to do. for that one. What a headbutt. Vicious. Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. Piercing the throat. He isn't finding any space to recover. Yeah, and he keeps struggling to slow the opposition down. Oh, shot right to the kidney. Repeated elbows to the lower back. To the outside. This could get wild. I don't know what he's got planned with that, but I know it ain't good. He climbs into the ring. Oh! Okay, this just got freaky. This got really freaky. Oh, oh no. Reverse DDT. Can he take advantage of this? Makes the cover. Wow, looks like this book has a couple more chapters in it. We might be seeing a whole saga written tonight. Listen, that should have ended things. And look at his face. At this point, you have to believe he's losing some faith in himself. Oh, man, he is fired up now. Close line right to the back of the neck. He's taking this to the floor now. 
Beautiful takedown into the Achilles lock. What a unique submission maneuver here. And look at the pain his opponent's in. All the pressure on the left knee. He's trying to fight it. He's trying to break out and does it. He leaves the ring and there's no count outs in this one. Climbs back inside. Close line. He's going for it all. He's positioning himself. Closing in. From the top. Good lord. Taking flight. Showing absolutely no apprehension to putting one's body on the line. Stretching and tearing at all the ligaments in the leg. They are looking to punish their opponent further, and here we are. Look at the angle. It's nasty. Look at the arm for a Fujiwara armbar. Ah, oh, Fujiwara armbar applied. A lot of momentum now on his side. He's mixing precision and physicality with his attacks here. <laughs> Float up. Uh-oh. Blow to the abdomen gets them out of that. Talk about dismantling your opponent. He's staring his opponent down, getting into that zone. Ah, claw to the face. Ripping at the eyes. Uh-oh. Look at this. After all we've seen, these men are still not finished. There's a fire burning inside these competitors that won't allow them to quit. Military press. He's begging him to get up so he can put him back down. Oh, no. Oh, the reverse DDT. Devastating. You can see he is feeling it now. Held in a perilous position. Oh, face first off the apron. And now thrown back into the ring. Arm control applied in a uh, work on the arm. Oh, what's coming here? Submission move being applied. There it is. It's not embarrassing to tap out. And this grueling match is now done. 
Here is your winner, Steve the Scoopian. Here's your winner after a truly intense match. No one was willing to give even a single inch of ground in this battle. At times, it seemed like these competitors were totally deadlocked, but here you see the one who prevailed. Wait, where am I? Or rather, when am I? Or more importantly, what the hell is that? Oh.